to come back to part 13 uh, to part 12 uh, in this episode I will show you how you can work with red file sync function which works synchronous synchronously uh, on your app so let's get started and the previous videos uh, we have learned how we can work with red file asynchronously but this time we want to work uh, synchronously and synchronous uh, you doesn't need to callback function and just add the sync after the read file okay now you can take that uh, in a variable okay and then cancel that lock data okay now if I if I change this with some changes okay now let's run up as you can see it reads the file as buffer but you can convert that to string by the string function okay now as you can see it some changes the file rate thank you for your uh, for your watching and see you in the next video goodbye